Hello everyone, my name is Will Brooks and my mission is to make coding fun and easy to learn. In today's lesson, we will learn four different ways we can center our text. So let's jump right in. The first way I'm going to show you to style your page in the, is in the HTML page itself and that's called inline styling. Not recommended because it's best to style your writing in the external style sheet, which I'll show you next. So we're going to go to line 11. I'm using Replit here to show this. And I'm going in the H1 tag space. We're going to type style equals quotation mark text align text dash align colon and then center. Those are going to be our three magic words text align center. We're going to use that all the time. Let's run this and you'll see that the the top one we will center this text is now centered. Okay, that's the first way is just put it right in the text on your index.html page. Style equals text align center. Now I'm going to delete that and I'm going to go into the external style sheet to show you another way. Okay, so let's go to our external style sheet I have here on the left right here and I'm going to click the style sheet and then we're going to we're going to first do it with the uh, universal selector and that's going to be the star or multiplication sign. Uh, space, curly bracket, space, and then again, text, our three magic words, text, align, colon, center. Okay, and that is that is going to center everything on the page. Let's hit run. Notice how everything is centered on the page with that star sign. Okay, so now let's get rid of that star sign. Let's see, what if we just want to center, and let's run that again. What if we want to center again the H1 tag? So we're going to type in here, go back in here, type in H1 space. Okay, H1 tag is the top sentence. Run it. Boom. We have we centered, we will center this text. Okay, now what if we want to center the P tags? Very easy. We just type in a P space because these two sentences here are from the P. P tags, run that. And then we center the, the, two, the second and third sentences there. Great. Okay, that's three ways we can do it there. Now, what if we want to, I'm going to go back to where we were before. What if we want to center just one of those, what the second sentence, this is sample sentence one. In that case, we are going to have to go back to our HTML page and we're going to use the class attribute. So I'm going to go back to the index.html page and we're going to do go down to line number 15, the first sentence. I'm going to click on the, we're going to put this in the opening of the p tag and we're going to use the class attribute c l a s s equals quotation now anything in here you can put anything you want in here we're just we're just naming it and i'm going to name it pizza just for this video because i like pizza so we're going to call this class pizza now if we run this nothing is going to happen because we have to go back to our external style sheet and where we have to define what we want to what we want to do here so let's go back to our external style sheet and instead of the uh, star or H1 or P, we're going to put in pizza. So we're going to put a dot. You need a dot and then P-I-Z-Z-A. Everything else we're going to leave the same, text align center. And now we're going to run this and you'll see the second sentence is centered right there. This is sample sentence one. Okay, so now, now that we have the the class defined, we can go back into our index. That last thing I'll show you, go back into our index. That, that, uh, index HTML page and go to the h1 tag and we can call this also class equals quotation pizza too. So now we can we can anything that we label pizza uh, will change to will be centered. See that how it's centered right there? Perfect. So that's centered as well. But you just gotta remember you gotta put that under your external style sheet as dot pizza or dot whatever name you want to call it and then curly brackets text align center. Okay well that brings us to the end of our video. I hope you learned a few ways to center your text. Please remember to like and subscribe below. If you have any questions or have anything else you'd like to learn, please leave me a note in the comments below. See you in the next video.